subscribe now and press the bell icon. Never miss an update. Hi friends, welcome to Manipal Kitchen. Today I would like to share the recipe of Masala Namak Pare, which is a very good evening snack to have with a cup of tea. So for that let's prepare the masala. Add 3 or 4 Kerala onions to a bowl and then add half inch ginger chopped into pieces then add 2 chopped green chilli it's as per your taste everything ok so 3 green uh, garlic pods minced and then add a handful of only coriander leaves no stem ok close lid and grind it to a fine paste so that we have we add this paste to the dough ok now add 1 cup rice atta fine rice atta to a bowl and add 1 fourth cup all purpose flour or maida and then add 1 fourth cup I have sieved this fine root suji and added okay in the atta sieber huh? okay then half teaspoon ajwain crushed with my hands and then I add 3 4 teaspoon salt to taste and 3 tablespoons of warm sunflower oil mix all till crumbled crumbled and when you crumble and hold it should hold shape like a laddu okay then add this grind paste which you just grind in the mixer mix it till combined and see that you you can make the soft dough adding this or even you can sprinkle a little bit of water and make a soft dough see it's a soft dough like a chapati dough, dough. and rest it for 30 minutes when you rest it for 30 minutes at times it turns harder and you may need to add a lot of water, little water. Now I think after resting let's check. No, it's quite soft. So knead well and pinch out a required small ball size dough. Knead it well inside out so that the color changes well. Look, I have kneaded it and then flatten it and dust it in either maida or rice atta, anything. And roll it with a rolling pin to a medium thickness not very thin to medium thickness okay no. maybe around 6 inches to 7 inches diameter oh, chapati like okay round roti then mark it as shown lengthwise you can make it into three p three markings like three pieces you can make i just made two then subsequently for the other roti i have just cut into three at times even four so it's become look see i'm showing it in a plate the ones which i have cut into namak pare now cooking oil is heated keep it on medium flame and slide a few namak rolled namak cut namak pare into it i have not pricked it because i want it because there are uh, kerum seeds it's but natural that it won't puff up well okay but it's it turns very crispy now fry on medium flame flip and fry see it's puffing up so well wow the color is so good and it's smelling so good now sizzling stops so just pick it up in this uh, meshed spatula shake well to drain all the extra oil and now transfer it to a colander already i have fried quite a lot So I'll show you how crispy it, it is in the next clipping. Look. So crispy and so yummy to enjoy with a cup of tea in this rainy season or winter. Please subscribe to my channel for wonderful recipes. And bye for now.